Staying in space can worsen cognitive abilities. Avionis in space can bounce on the cognitive abilities of astronauts. Difficult working conditions, environment microgravity, exposure to higher doses of radiation all this it affects the human body and mind. In addition, the astronauts have to perform various, often very complex tasks, and in space even the slightest error it can have catastrophic consequences. Scientists have studied 25 astronauts who have averaged to International Space Station ISS, six months. The results of the work showed, being on the ISS, the astronauts had a worse memory, it was harder for them focus on tasks, and the speed of thinking and assy thing also left a lot to wishes for a wish. However, scientists did not observe signs of permanent deterioration of function cognitive in the subjects. Results and description of the work appeared in the magazine Frontiers in Physiology. Space is an extreme environment that reduced gravity and strong radiation. However, little is known for the theme of how the environment and long-term stay in it affects the cognitive abilities of astronauts. To fill these gaps in knowledge scientists from NASA they studied 25 astronauts who spent an average of six months in space on aboard the ISS researchers checked whether and what changes occurred in them in scope cognitive functions during their stay in space. Scientists tested selected astronauts. Some of the they were carried out on Earth, before and after the mission, others aboard the ISS both at the beginning and at a later stage of the mission. These tests measured cognitive abilities and consisted, for example, in finding patterns on a grid in the purpose of testing abstract reasoning or choosing the appropriate the moment of stopping the inflatable balloon before cracking for purpose testing the ability to take risks. Tests have shown that processing speed, working memory, and the attention was more slower in astronauts than on Earth, but not less accurate. Changes however, these did not last long. For example, slowing the attention it was observed only at the beginning of the mission, while the speed slowdown the processing did not return to the baseline until the mission is complete and the crew return to Earth said Dr. Sheena Dev of NASA. Overall, the cognitive performance of the astronauts was stable and investigators found no evidence to suggest central damage the nervous system during a six-month space mission. We show that there is no evidence of any significant impairment cognitive functions in astronauts who spent six months on the ISS. The life and work in space did not involve widespread impairment of function cognitive, which would suggest significant brain damage, Dev said. These studies have shown that some cognitive areas were more susceptible to the influence of space than others. It will have probably reflected in the planning of future space missions, especially the long-term ones. Even on Earth, the speed of processing or attention are areas cognitive, which may show temporary changes when a person is stressed. Other areas, such as memory, are less prone to stressors. To the example if you have a really busy day but didn't sleep well previous night, you may feel like you are hard to focus or you need more time to complete your tasks, Dev explained. Astronauts are also exposed to these stressors, and these the extra ones that are unique to the cosmos are also taking their toll. And we found that the most vulnerable areas when astronauts are on the ISS, they are the same as those that are more susceptible to stressors on Earth. Dev admitted it. These studies can help you better understand what changes in cognitive fitness can be expected when people are in the extreme environments. However, as the authors of the study pointed out, they did not show they are why these changes happened. This work was also not aimed at making assessments of whether the operational efficiency of the astronauts suffered. 
It may turn out that even in areas where declines were observed, astronauts were still and it will be compensated and effectively performed on your tasks she said. Dev. Scientists have described the shape of a single photon. British scientists have developed a computer model explaining how the light and matter interacts at the quantum level. Thanks to this, they also managed to create an image showing the exact shape of a single photon. Research conducted by researchers from the University of Birmingham in the UK concerned the nature of photons and unprecedented the details of the scholars described how light and matter interact with each other at the quantum level, as photons are emitted by atoms or molecules and as they are shaped by the surrounding environment. The results and description of these works appeared in the magazine The Physical Review Letters. The photon is an elementary particle that belongs to the bosons. There is a carrier of electromagnetic interactions. It has no electrical charge, and his resting mass is zero. Photon has both particle characteristics and electromagnetic wave, what is his dualism the corpuscular wave. The light is spreading it is as a wave, but can also be described using separate packages energy which we call photons. Created by researchers from the University of Birmingham model computer created to better understand how light and matter they're acting on each other. This is an extremely difficult task, but the team succeeded to simplify the problem. Interactions of light and matter lead to infinite the possibility of the existence and spread of light in the surrounding them the environment. This makes these interactions extremely difficult to model. By segregating these possibilities into separate sets, researchers were able to rise developing a model that describes not only the interactions between the photon and the emitter, but also how energy from this interaction moves. By the way they used their calculations to create a visualization of the photon itself. Our calculations have allowed us to transform seemingly an unsolvable problem in something that can be calculated. As a byproduct of the model, we were able to create a picture of a photon, something that had not been seen before physics, said Dr. Benjamin Yoon from the University of Birmingham, first author the publication. This work opens up new research paths for physicists quantum and for science scholars. Thanks to the possibilities precisely define how a photon interacts with matter and others elements of their environment, scientists can design new technologies nanophotonic that could change the way we communicate, we detect pathogens or control chemical reactions at the molecular level. Geometry and optical properties of the environment are deep consequences for the method of photon emission including the shape of a photon, color, and even the probability of its existence explained Professor Angela Dimitriata from the University of Birmingham, CEO author of the publication. The interaction between the individual photons and matter is very important in quantum mechanics. It drives a number of different mechanisms some of them are fundamental to many of the technologies we use every day. Understanding the interaction was a monumental task. The light spreading through the environment has unlimited possibilities the interaction. This work helps us better understand the energy exchange between light and matter, and secondly, better understanding of how light it affects its close and further environment. Much of this information was previously considered a simple noise, but in this SM there is a lot of information, which we can now understand and use. We have created the basics to be able to design light material interactions for future applications such as better sensors, improved photovoltaic cells or quantum computers he said Yoon. 05 a